In our Health Watch report, a new study suggests for some teens and young adults, cannabis comes with a high health risk. Local 3's Connie Feldman has more. A new survey of 8th and 10th graders shows a growing number of teens smoke pot daily. A newly published study suggests pot may pose serious problems for young people with mood disorders. Recent reports have found teen marijuana use at its highest level in 30 years, with high school students more likely to smoke pot than tobacco, despite lingering questions about marijuana's health effects. Ohio State behavioral scientist Cynthia Fonatella works with young people with mood disorders, including major depression and bipolar disorder. We notice, you know, a high prevalence of cannabis use and cannabis use disorders in this population, and we were curious about what the negative effects of that was on their uh, trajectory for mood disorders. In a study published in the journal JAMA Pediatrics, Fonatella detailed findings from a review of 200 5,000 Ohio Medicaid claims linked with death certificates for young people 10 to 24. The researchers found youths with mood disorders who used marijuana were at a higher risk for self-harm and death by all causes, including overdose and homicide. The common misconceptions and attitudes is that marijuana is harmless which it's not. Fonatella says cannabis use might worsen the symptoms of mood disorder and interfere with treatments. They say decreasing usage among young people might reduce the risk. Fontanella says a national study of mortality risk for young adults with mood disorders and cannabis would be the next step. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Connie Fellman, Local 3 News.